have a, a bunch of samples yeah. right here. And you know, Greg, that brings up a great example. Students who come here to the school, uh, a real uh, cross-section of folks like our viewers, coming from all parts of not only this country, but Canada and other parts of the world. And when, they, when they're here and, and using our materials, our local materials, they say, but I can't get that at home where I live. You know, what are my options? Yeah, and it really depends on where you are. Yeah. You know, if you're up in Newfoundland, you're not going to be getting our cedar up there, but you might get some nice spruce. Yeah. And so up there, and, and for us, we would consider it not particularly durable, but it's a different, different water conditions and different uses up there. So, but let us see what happens with this. This is a real cr crowd pleaser, so check this out. Uh, yeah, so here we have a, a, a slip of red oak right here. And I'm just gonna take, take this and I'm gonna stick this into this water here. Yeah, and that's, that is uh, somewhat problematic uh -huh. with construction. Because with, with those uncorked tubing, I guess you could say, a bunch of pipettes, you know, like from science class, and it, it just draws water up through it, right where you don't want to have water in, in, you know, out of the sunlight and where it stays continually damp. Mm -hmm.